Hey everyone, look, this is kind of going to be a short video about uh, about this whole Wall Street bets and, you know, sticking it to the hedge funds, shorting them, squeezing them out. I, I And I have a lot of friends that are investing money and I wanted to address, well, well you and anybody else that's investing money like the, the GameStop or AMC or, or whatever. Look, this is the stock market and... If you're the kind of person that doesn't have a lot of money, then don't invest money that you don't have. So, and by the way, if you don't know what I'm talking about, like go do a search for um, Reddit subreddit of Wall Street bets, and then how you're um, squeezing out short sellers uh, that are hedge, that are hedge funds. Um, that's I'm not going to get into that. Um, one, it's a little complicated because you're one markets. Hedge funds are basically saying, I'm going to bet that the stock goes down and I'm going to borrow shares to sell later and, and make a profit. And then uh, the other side is saying, no, we're going to pump this stock up and then rise the price so it's not going to go down and then you'll lose money, big rich hedge fund. Look, whatever your justification is for sticking it to the rich, that, that's really all you. But this is about the small-time investor that is spending his or her money to to play in this game and let's let's be clear right now if i'm looking at my my screen this is um 3 20 hawaii time on the 2nd of february 2021 and right now the share price closed at 90 dollars a share down 60 percent uh from where it was uh, the high point was january 28th $469.42 and it takes this wild ride and so what this video is about is saying look if you bought these shares to play this game to try to stick it to the rich person I got news for you first those hedge funds all these rich fat cats on Wall Street they've got backup plans they have a lot of capital laying around you know what and and I agree like that you should be allowed to play this game too and they because they play the same game but the game you're playing they have more knowledge than you so i'm not telling you not to do this i'm just telling you be careful for example if it's 90 dollars closed now and you bought your shares at let's say yesterday about this time 227 dollars at two o'clock yesterday and then now it's 90 like if you bought at 227 to hold and then like you were waiting for it to go again, but now it's only worth 90. You, you lost a lot of money. And that loss to you means more than some rich fat cat. Do you get it? Do you, do you get it? Don't play this game unless you're prepared to lose. If there's a moral to this entire story, that's it. Don't play this financial stock market game unless you're ready to lose. You might be the person that bought low and sold high and you made some money, but the odds are you're not and you're gonna lose it, it sucks it sucks it sucks when people that don't have a lot of money lose money because it hurts you more let me give you an example if you're rich and you got a a hundred dollar speeding ticket it's not a big deal right you can shell out the hundred but if you're poor and you got a hundred dollar speeding ticket that means a lot more to you doesn't it it hurts you more so please folks please if you're going to play this game, think about how it's going to be when it's time to cash out. And think about this. Think about this. How is it going to end? How is, how is this all going to end? All right. Good luck. Good luck. See you later.